Hi everyone, today I'm going to be talking about how to run a scan on PowerSuite Pro and what your options are. If you want to run a scan, you've got several options with PowerSuite. Here on the overview page, you can just click on this arrow and you can choose to either run a quick scan or a deep scan. A quick scan will take only a few seconds and it will search for problems using the optimization tools here on the left. Let's just show you what a quick scan looks like. Ok, as you can see, I've got some problems in a number of areas. Now, if I run a deep scan, PowerSuite is still going to search all the items I just showed you on the left, but it will also search these items here on the right, and this will identify any areas you may need to clean up or optimise. This will take a little longer, so let's just have a look and fast forward a little bit. And again, issues arise here, which I'll leave a see to as well. Now, as you can see written here, you will need to go through these optimization tools individually and fix them as you'd like. If you wanted to, you could click this button for your one-click fix, and PowerSuite will take care of both your active speed tools and your quick scan problems all at once, but we'll get back to that later. If you're a bit curious about what all the optimization tools do, or you'd like to fix a problem found by your deep scan, you can go ahead and click the PC optimization tab here. And as you can see, you can click through all of these individual items on the left. And depending on what you want to fix or if you need a little bit more detail, you can just go through these tabs. And you can scan them all individually, or you can fix them all individually too. If there's something you don't want to delete, you can use this ignore button here to keep those files safe whilst you optimise your PC. For the deep scan options, such as compress files or PC Startup Optimizer, remember that PowerSuite is going to report them to you, but you're going to have to click here and deal with the issues individually. So don't forget to take a look through them whilst you're browsing through the optimization tab. Once you've had a better look through the various options you have, or you've finished using the optimization tools, you can always go ahead and click back to the overview tab. And here you can choose the one click fix option. And there you go, the scan's done and the files are all fixed and it's as simple as that. Thanks for watching and please feel free to leave me any comments or questions that you might have.